everybody, I was saying this before, like, uh, you ever notice, like, when those women, those women, the white women that are married to athletes, they get a nanny as soon as they have a baby. That's because they didn't want the baby in the first place. They only had the baby to marry onto their husband's wealth. And the reason a lot of black athletes don't speak out and agree with Kaepernick is because they have white families now. You know, they once they get, you know, once they get a white woman, once they make a little money, they go get a white wife. And in their mind, they're dying and going to heaven. And the reason they don't join along with Kaepernick and agree with him is because they don't want to offend their white side of the family. And quiet as it's kept, when those guys become NFL players and NBA players, they sign contracts that ties their hands behind their back and they can't speak out about social issues that take place here in America. You know, they'll lose a lot of endorsements if they do. You know, it's real simple. And people keep talking about, like, black women are gold diggers. Nah. White women are gold diggers too. You know, they only marry, you never hear stories about white women marrying poor black men. They only marry men that are well off, athletic athletes that are well off. They don't go in the ghetto and marry poor black men. They're looking for a man that's making some money. You know, because in mind, they're gold diggers. And, and, you know, on average, the athlete, the black man don't live as long, the, on average, men don't live as long as they're women. You know what I'm saying? So once he dies, she and, and she's got the wealth, she keeps it on her white side of the family. The money don't go on the black side of the family because a lot of times these guys disassociate themselves from their families. You know, they don't go back to their neighborhood. They they don't do... It's real simple, man. Basically, that's why I like these guys that I speak it out. All right, y'all, I'm out of here.